there is confusion over implementation of new adoption rules that require transfer of adoption petitions from courts to district magistrates. And parents, adoption agencies and activists are worried that this could lead to further delays and in a long procedure. That the Parliament in July 2021 passed the Juvenile Justice, Care and Protection of Children Amendment Bill 2021 which empowers DMs to give adoption orders. Ironically, the intent of the amendment was to prevent court-related delays during adoptions because of a large number of pending cases. The amendments came into effect from September 1, according to a Gazette notification issued on 31st August. Thereafter, amendments to the Juvenile Justice, Care and Protection of Children Model Rules 2016 were notified with state, all the cases pertaining to adoption matters pending before the court shall stand transferred to the district magistrate from the date of commencement of these rules. So let's take a look at the eligibility criteria for prospective adoptive parents. First, the prospective adoptive parents shall be physically, mentally and emotionally stable, financially capable and shall not have any life-threatening medical condition. Second, any prospective adoptive parents irrespective of his marital status and whether or not he has biological son or daughter can adopt a child subject to following namely a. The consent of both the spouses for the adoption shall be required in case of a married couple. b. A single female can adopt a child of any gender. c. A single male shall not be eligible to adopt a girl child. Third, no child shall be given in adoption to a couple unless they have at least two years of stable marital relationship. Fourth, the age of prospective adoptive parents as on the date of registration shall be counted for deciding the eligibility and the eligibility of prospective adoptive parents to apply for children of different age groups shall be as shown.